There are a lot of techniques uh, that we use both in the open surgery and in the laparoscopic surgery that have allowed us to finesse our surgeries quite uh, extensively over the past decade or so or even more to the point where we can really minimize side effects from surgery and complications from surgery. We have a very robust robotics program, uh, which means there are many, many surgeons who perform many, many, many robotic surgeries. It has allowed for increased precision in the OR. The visualization is significantly better. It also added a depth perception to the minimally invasive surgery where we didn't have that with standard laparoscopy. So we are able to perform our surgeries with much, much, much greater precision. Um, we are able to get into deep spaces where we couldn't have laparoscopically before and perform more complex surgeries. We have been on the leading forefront of advancements in the robotic surgery. Personally, I was, uh, I think, one, no, I was the first gynecologic surgeon to perform a single site robotic surgery. We have some surgical protocols that were open. Uh, one of the research protocols that we were looking at was looking at um, sentinel lymph node mapping, so that's specific lymph node dissection for uterine cancer, which decreases postoperative complications. We have since completed that trial and have shown that here at the Cancer Center, we provide an extremely high level of care. We were looking at uh, molecular profiling in various gynecologic cancers, and actually we had an abstract presented at our most recent national society looking at different um, mutations in different types of gynecologic cancers and whether or not um, they correlate with outcomes. In our division, we're fortunate enough to work with residents in the field of OBGYN, so we work with them uh, on research projects as well, uh, various types of research. Actually, now I am currently uh, one of the um, co-primary investigators on a research protocol looking at the use of Zoom and webinar in the career advancements of medical students. We are very, very involved in offering the um, the latest cutting edge treatments, whether technology, technologically, surgically in the operating room or treatments on trials, protocols um, that are available. We have a wide variety of protocols and trials that are available to patients. And I think that's unique that we have that here and, and we're lucky and fortunate to be able that to offer to people to give them the best care that's out there.